everybody, what the fuck is going on? Welcome back to Cooking with Bird Martinez. The one, the only, Bird motherfucking Martinez, bitch. What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing? How's everybody and their mama doing? I hope you're doing good in the motherfucking neighborhood. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> okay, bitch. So, first of all, I'm going to tell you guys, if I sound a little apresurada, like, like I'm trying to hurry up, it is because I'm trying to hurry up. Because today we're going to make Mario's favorite food. And see, he's peeking in again. This is like his third time. Like, is a Milanese already? Is a Milanese already? And I'm like, I'm trying to defrost that bitch. So hold up. Wait a minute. Let me put some pimping in it, bitch. Calmate, Erika. Calmate. Bird, calmate. But anyways, Sofia La Tortilla's over there. She's making an apple pie. I don't know. I don't really, really know what she's doing, pero... She thinks she knows what she's doing. Okay, so for my shout outs, bitch. Okay, shout out to Aaliyah Nabe. Did I say it right? N A B A A Y Nabe. Leonardo and Isaiah from Oregon. And Layla, Lila, right? From El Paso, Texas. What the fuck is going on? Also, I, will, I wanna send a really special shout out to Dora Trevino. She's always showing me love. You know what I'm saying? She actually emails emailed me back when there was the fires in um here in California. She's like, Bird, are you okay? I just want to make sure you're okay. You know, and your kids and and even now when the um, coronavirus shit started, she was like, You need anything? Hit me up. Like, girl, <laughs> thank you. Not even like people that I know, like that I know, don't fucking rock with me like that. So thank you very much from the bottom of my heart. Okay, motherfuckers. So, today I'm gonna make some milanesa. Milanesa that is beef, boneless, sirloin, something steak. So, this is, I took off the plasticky stuff because then I forget it was, how much was it for a pound? $3.49 for a pound, and we got six pounds in this bitch. Up in this bitch, because when I make this, I make it for like three days. I also make it into torta. So, we're gonna use breadcrumbs. Um, this is not the one that I use, but Mario's, Mario's gonna go work out right now. Huh, Mario? No quiere hablar ese way. Because I couldn't find the Kellogg brand, Kellogg brand, um, breadcrumbs. So we're gonna make our own. We're gonna remix this to this remix right here. Yeah, ching is mine. ¿Qué pasa, Mario Martinez? Le huelen los calcetines. We're also gonna use some huevos. Bye. Bye, chulada. Bye, chorizo. He's gonna go get, you know, get that chest right. I'm also gonna use four eggs. We're gonna use some milk. Milk. And for the, um, I'm gonna show you guys how to make the salsa. Mario's favorite salsa. He wants me to title it Mario's favorite salsa. But whatever. Hi, Mandy. Mandy's like, oh my God, it's for God, it's for God, it's cheese, man. Today she was cleaning her face when, um, with, ¿cómo se llama? Zote. Jabon zote. And here it is. And I told her to wrap it up. And look. Guys, she got white. You know that lady that was talking shit in Mexico? She's from Honduras. She was like, Este jabón es de perro. Este jabón es de perro. We use this jabón. The fuck? Jabón sote. It's good for your skin. I used it this morning too. Look. Look at that. Look at that. Yes, I'm a perra. Soy una perra sucia. So anyways, let's do this bitch because Mario's hungry. He's gonna work out, but let's do it. Yeah, say hi, Sofia. Hello. Um, aquí está, tiene sus little apples. Aquí está su little, ¿cómo se llama? My dough. Your dough. That dough, dough. Y aquí tengo mis plátanos machos for later. Yes, and I got this. <laughs> Así es loca. Ignore our walls. We got fucked up walls. Kids, the walls are gonna feel that shit. Unless your kids are like sitting in the corner, not doing nothing. And your walls are gonna be perfect. I remember when I was a little girl, my tia used to sit my ass down, don't move, don't do nothing. So I was like, bitch, when I grow up, I'm gonna let my fucking kids fly. Coco, coco, fly and let the motherfuckers be kids. Shit. Ugh. So I'm gonna use this. Yes, I use ligas to cover them. Because you don't want them to get like too dry and shit. That's what I do, Scooby Doo. Water to boil. Este, because once it starts boiling, I'm gonna throw the tomatillos up in there, bitch. I wash them tomatillos like you wash that egg. They are. Mira que chulada. Um, so, somebody on my Snapchat asked me what's the difference between the big ones and the little ones. So, the little ones have more flavor. The big ones have a little more acidy flavor. 
or tart is that what the fuck you call it it's the also some of the big ones when you get them they're a little hollow so i don't know i get like um both of them so i could do a little remix but the perfect tomatillo is green like this bitch right here so fucking beautiful i used to just get them in whatever but now i take off the little como se dice the skin somebody told me the fucking name of the skin they take off the fucking husk tusk husk some shit and um then i is to put them in the little baggie shout out to the guy from el super he was so fucking nice bro he was like oh i take care i've been doing this for 14 years and he was helping me he's the real motherfucker put him in there and once it starts boiling you take him out you take him out you turn it off because then it's gonna boil and boil and it's gonna take the color out and what do we want the color that's why when i send my salsas i get sad because i have to boil the whole mason jar so it doesn't look as green as it, i want it to but chinga su madre you know gotta do what you gotta do scooby-doo okay, so we are gonna put the cereal the kellogg's whatever the fuck you call it el cereal del gallito that's what mexicans call it el del gallo I used to put it in the blender, but it would blend too much, and we don't want it to be too blended. So we're gonna use this motherfucker right here. I already see it. So look, that's why I like to buy the one that's already made. Cause look, out of all that cereal, it only made a little bit. Pero it is what it is. So the consistency that you want, you don't want it too big or too small. So I think I'm gonna give it another blend, and I'll show you guys how it looks, bitch. This is the as much as I, it could do with this shit right here. So I'm gonna do it with my hands. Also, what I used to do, I used to get a plastic bag, put the cereal in there, and then like smash it up like that. Pero ya ves, trying to do something different. Sale madreada la chingadera. Yeah, so just use your hands. If you don't want to use your hands, you can use your bubble. Everybody acting like, oh my god, you can't use your hands anymore. I use my hands with everything. Yes, I'm washing them. But no, I'm not gonna put gloves. Mario told me you should put gloves to cook because people are gonna think it's nasty or did it. Mario, I told him I'm cooking for my damn family. It's not like I'm cooking for like people like como se dice, like selling food. For the when I'm doing the salsas, I'm very careful. Si estoy sterilizing whatever the fuck, los de esos chingaderas, las mason jars. So you know what I'm saying? Pero también como poner pinches guantes para todo. I can't. I just can't. I'm not trying to be a fake ass bitch. I'm gonna put the other breadcrumbs that we found. And we're gonna remix that bitch in there. Okay, so it could all get blended. This is what it looks like, bitch. So it has like the little crumbs and then it has big crumbs. So it's all good in the motherfucking neighborhood. Now, we're gonna get the meat ready. Okay, so the meat is easy peasy mac and cheesy. You could season it if you want. The salt pepper, whatever the fuck you want, chicken flavoring or whatever they call it, chicken bouillon flavoring. Pero since I'm gonna make the salsa, it just gives it a lot of fucking flavor. I've never seasoned it, but that's just me. I have gone to restaurants where they um they serve the milanesa. You could taste the seasoning. Pero como yo no, I've never, that's not the way I was taught. I'm just gonna keep the recipe how it is. So this is Mario's favorite food. His mom taught me so cuando llegué aquí a la casa, este, es lo primero que aprendí. You know what I'm saying? And I, I just know how to cook this because it's Mario's favorite food. So I know how to cook this. Este, longaniza en chile verde, pollo en chile rojo. Those are like the main things that I learned as a, as a youngster. But other than that, I didn't know how to do shit, bitch. But anyways, I like to cook with this because it's very thin, the meat. So it turns crunchy. It's going to turn crunchy and good. And the maize bones. Let me, let me tell you guys that Mandy's, this is Mandy's favorite food. And this the baby Mario's. And she likes it too. So a secret that Mario's um, grandmother gave me was to add milk. Instead to the, to this so it could get tender. So one time I was in the van with the grandma. And she's like, ¿Qué vas a hacer de comer? What are you going to make to eat? And every time I would tell her I was gonna make to eat, she would give me her little two cents. That's why I like that lady, cause she helped me learn. For this bitch, and it's the unos 10, 15 minutes. So it'll get tender and sexy and shit. And then we're gonna, um, como empanizarlas. I'll show you guys how to do it. Actually, Mandy's gonna help me. Okay, okay. My little setup, I put aluminum foil. Wait, I put aluminum foil 
right here, right? And then I put more lumen foil. And don't worry, I got the, the lumen foil from um, Smart and Final. It's the best lumen foil you could get because not that thick one. I like the thin one. And it will last you the whole damn year, bitch. It's this one. We barely opened it and just watch. I'll let you guys know when it finishes. And I use a lot of shit. So, let me get this shit set up. So you're gonna put the breadcrumbs right here up in this bitch. All up in that hole. And you're gonna spread them butt cheeks like this. I'm showing you guys and Mandy at the same time. The same damn time. ¿Verdad, Mandy? Sí. Y Mandy se mira bien bonita. Se peinó la vieja. Se peinó la chulada. Okay. We're gonna get a piece of meat. Oh, this one's fucking big. Fuck it. She needs some other. This is the one that you guys got. See, like, this one has a bunch of holes. But whatever. I think I need one more egg. Tengo otro huevo, mami. Sí. Just because it needs it needs it para que se pegue. The egg is like the glue. Aquí echalo en el in the meat. And then what I do is like tap it, tap it. It's gonna be a little bit different today, Mandy, because the no, it's still gonna be good. The crumbs. The crumbs. I we couldn't find the ones that we usually use. So I have to make our own. So I guess Mandy knows more than me. She said we had some in the little cuartito in the pantry. That's what she, we call it, cuartito. Um, so this is how they're supposed to look. So I'm just gonna throw that bitch in there. See, the color is mm. different. <laughs> it's so good, though, mama. It's still gonna be bomb. Skis, skis, motherfucker. I don't all the remix it to the remix it to chingada madre remix. Chinga su madre. Okay, now we're gonna put the milanesa. I'm gonna tap, tap, tap. See? Este se agarró más. With more egg huevito and more lechita and more everything. These are gonna cook right, right away. Yeah, right away. Porque they're thin. Ooh. And get all the corners así. Because sometimes you forget to get the corners. So then when you're about to eat it, you're like, oh, this part, it doesn't have bread. So ya no está igual, no está igual de bueno. Si? Mira que chulada. Así está. Okay. So while Mandy's doing this, este, I am going to make the salsa. Porque el arroz ya se hizo. Motherfuckers, so now I'm going to get the chilitos. This salsa, one time. I, I, always, I would always make the same side, the same, the green, green one. But one time I'm like, let me add a little something. And let me do this and let me do that. And when I gave it to Mario, he was like, bitch, I love you more than yesterday. No, he didn't say that, but I saw his little, you know, eye sparkle. But also this, um, what I do is I heat up the comal and then I turn it off. So just heat them, heat in, heating them up, but not burning them. So I'm going to move them to the side. Y ahorita I'm going to show you what I remix to the remix um, with the cilantro. Also be careful. No se vayan a quemar. Like me, I have all these burns on me. I'm so fucking stupid. It's stupid. Did you guys hear that? Tekashi Sick 9 came out of jail. Que porque tiene asthma. He, now he has asthma, right? <laughs> I don't care. I like his music. I know people are like, ah, oh, he's a fucking snitch. What do you I don't really give a fuck about that. That's him and his shit. Uh, the only thing I didn't like is they were like, it's the giving death threats to his mom, no? Sí. That shit's fucked up. So my mom's like a Mexican old lady. Se mira bien, pinche Mexican acá. She doesn't deserve that so shit. So this is what I put on the salsa. Cilantro. Cebolla. Garlic, of course. And the chilitos in the bottom so they could blend, okay? Because you put them on the top, they're just going to be chilling over there in the top. And nothing's gonna happen. And the tomatillos, I let them cool down on that ass. Mm. Así porque, if you let the to put the tomatillos hot, they're gonna cook up the, the damn cilantro. I mean, they're still tibios, they're a little hot. But see how the color is? Some of them are like not fully cooked, but they're gonna get cooked. Oh, whoop -de -woo -woo. Nah, 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 nah. It looks better with the jabonzote thing. Bitch, is that the new secret? What the fuck? What the fuck is going on? Pero no. Um, I always wash my face with like soap that people wash their hands with. I even wash my face with soap that people wash the dishes with. 
The fancy one is Mandy. She'll be washing her face with, um, este. Face wash. Oh, that's not even fancy, though. That's just <laughs> regular. <laughs> Set a fill. Don't forget the salt. Like that much. Measurements by Bird Martinez Beach. Ooh. Smells good. Mario, se está partiendo la madre allá. Este, he's working out with some big ass rusty weeds. He was telling me how they're so expensive. Like the fucking bar, the bar you know that you use to lift weights. How much did he say it was? $300 or something? Damn, damn, bitch. No water added, bitch. It looks like, ooh. Yeah, the, the um, cilantro is not all green because the tomatillos were a little bit warm, but it's all good in the Thick, hood. like I like my man. Ooh. Mira que chula. Mandy, look at her. She's so beautiful. So gorgeous. Except she says it's taking a long time. You thought it was going to be fun? Sí. Why do you think my back always hurts when I make milanesas? Because oh, no. it's a whole thing. <laughs> I'm going to show you guys a little gym de Mario. Ay, mira que chula. De hombre. My chorizo. Yeah, 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 pues ya. Look, he even has the weights in the damn... <laughs> and then carrito with the cats next to you. Fuck it. I need to get fresh air. And I got my stuff over here for the damn este salsas. Yep. And this is already done by the one, the only marvelous Mandy. And the salsas right there. Now I'm gonna make the milanesas for real. And Mandy's washing the dishes. We're out of soap. Yes. It's all over. It's over. I could do it. Okay. You could do it, put your back into it. But remember, wash the inside and the outside. See. Okay, okay. Yes, I, it didn't get dry though. You're supposed to turn it around. Did you dry it? Mm -hmm. Oh, Mandy, what she does to me. <laughs> she goes for everything. We're like fucking sitting down and she's like, <gasps> and I'm like, what happened? Like freaking out. And she's like, oh, I dropped the soap. Or like, <laughs> like some hair is on her face. <laughs> Molino. And she's like, oh, can you check if there's a fork in there? Can <laughs> someone get a fucking heart attack, bro? For real, for real. Anyways, so you have to have the oil. Ay, wait, you have to have the oil ready. Calientita. And also get like a container because when it comes out, you want them to stay, to drain because it's gonna have oil. And also get some thongs. So what I do, what I do is I'm gonna put some holes in them. Put some holes in this hole. I see? And put it on the side. I'm gonna get some thong. And one time at Walmart. Okay. So my shoes are dirty. And look at my shoes. I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> She went, <"Hey!" laughs> And they were like, These two people walking next to us. And they went like this. Like, oh shit, like, what happened? And she's like, I'm like, Your shoes are dirty, really? And then I started laughing, like cracking up, and then the girls were like dying también de la... Esta pinche que hablan ahí. Las mamadas. Okay. So, yes. Ah, it's enough. It's hot enough. It's supposed to... It's gonna get harder. And put them holes in there. Put them holes in there. Even the little pieces. We use all of it. Little pieces, big pieces, medium pieces. Every piece. Count. So like a minute, two minutes, see how it starts changing color? That's when you know it's about to go down. So if you do them too much, too long, it's that they get hard. But if you don't do it enough time, it's not good. So be careful. Pero mira, mira que chula. Well, it looks like crunchy, crunch, crunch, crunch for that ass. Mario's already ready. He says he got tired doing the weights outside. I guess because he's not used to it. It's different, right? Mm -hmm. This virus shit is fucking shit. It's fucking everybody up. I heard a lot of people are getting fired and stuff. Oh, tell him about that email. The grease guy. Oh, okay, so 
this guy from Greece, I think so. Is he? Yeah, he's from Greece. And he said that, um, that Greece has more culture and is Hindi than all of Mexico. But he was just talking about Mexican America stuff. No, but he was telling me that I need to shut the fuck up. Um, because I have no culture, Mexicans don't have this, and Mexicans, he was like super racist, and he wrote an email like two pages long. Huh, oh, man, you see, he never talked about something actually Mexican, just Mexican American. Like, you should compare Greece Americans to Mexican Americans. You can see, it's different. But no, he took his time to write too little. Oh, man, I didn't write back. I'm not gonna fight with some dumbass I don't even know. I just like the good emails, the emails that like uplift me, you know, I'll write back to them. But to the little bitches, hell nah. I ain't wasting my motherfucking time. Hell to the no, no, no. When you guys heat up the arroz, the rice, put it in a bag and then put it in the microwave so all the like steam gets with it and it doesn't get hard. Because before I used to just put it in a plate and I'm like, why is my rice so hard? But like this, it gets soft. And you know, it's you don't want people to think, oh, my rice, your, her rice is so hard. It's not your fault. When you heat it, it gets hard sometimes. I'm just saying, people like to be like, mmm, her food is nasty. I never talk about people's food. I don't like to. I mean, I would say it with my family sometimes if it's really, really bad. But I won't ever disrespect somebody by making a face. Hell no. My mom raised me better than that shit. Somebody's feeding you? You shut the fuck up. I mean, unless it's your wife or your husband. You could be honest, but don't be rude. Don't be like, oh, that's nasty or whatever. The first time I made pancakes, Mario. The first time I made pancakes for Mario, he was all happy and all excited making, making pancakes. And then he's cutting them up. And then he's like, how did you get this gooey stuff in the inside? Like he thought it was like a special pudding or something. And I, the thing was, I didn't even cook the damn pancake right. But he was all happy. Like, thank you, boo boo. Mario's so funny. También on his birthday, he, his 18th birthday? No. 19th, 18th birthday. I came to his house and I um I gave him a balloon with the with a card. Cause I was all happy because it was his first my first birthday with him. Or his first birthday with me. And then later on he told me that he was upset because he opened the card and there was no money in the inside. I was like, motherfucker, you should have been Happy that I even gave you anything. You know what I'm saying? So anyways, go like this. I'm so happy. You're so happy for a kid. Because that's my third favorite food. Your third favorite food? Who dances for food? Sofia. Mm -hmm. La motherfucking Sofia. Ahí está. Somos ready. Make sure you go like this. Because we're going to eat pura grease. We don't want that. And your bird just gives greasy ass fucking this thing. recipes. I try to be good, you know. I want to tell you guys about a girl that DM me. I was talking to you about it, huh, Randy? Yes. It says, so there's this girl, right? And she said that she has been friends with the gr another girl for 12 years, but then they disconnected and then they connected again. So the girl asked her if she wanted to have a threesome with her, her boyfriend, whatever. So then. I guess the girl's like, hell no, you know the girl that wrote, she's like, hell no, like, I'm not into that, I'm not like that. But then the other, um, I guess she left her phone wherever, like somewhere, and her boyfriend saw it. And her boyfriend was like, um, what the fuck is this? Like, he did, he's like, why didn't you tell me? And then she said, oh, because I thought it was a joke, I didn't take it that serious. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Mira que chulada. So then, the other girl, um... She, this girl, well, the girl that the Emmy told the other girl, like, why did you write that? Why did you say that? And she's like, oh, I, I thought you knew that it was a joke. But to me, it wasn't a joke. I don't think it was a joke. Why would she bring that up? She said she didn't even get along with her like that. It wasn't like they joked around like that. I think she wanted to do that with her. Pero luego, she, como she got like, um, wasn't like, like rejected. She wanted to play it off like, oh, I'm just kidding. But then the worst part was that the other bitch um, on her twi Twitter on her Twitter started talking shit about this girl started saying, oh, um, her boyfriend controls her. Her boyfriend doesn't let her wear this, doesn't let her wear that. She has a fucking, you know, como se dice? No. Where you have like certain money, like a, like. Oh, yeah. Um, it's called, it's called allowance. Allowance, yeah, that she has an allowance. That's the word that she's t told me. 
and it's not true. And then she wanted to say something, but she doesn't have a Twitter. So this is my little two cents. I think that that bitch wanted you. Maybe you're too nice. I think you're nice because the girls that try to get girls try to get girls to do other shit is a too nice. I tell you, See? don't be too fucking nice because these mm -hmm. bitches are fucking snakes. You know what I'm saying? So she thought that you were too nice. She thought she was gonna get you, but now your boyfriend is in, in the remix. So she's like, Ugh, the boyfriend. She probably doesn't like your boyfriend. And she wants to say shit about you. So she's like, but her. So let her, let her bark. Let these bitches bark. In my opinion, the best thing to do is like, or maybe, mm -hmm. sue her for defamation of character. Sue her? <laughs> See, you could do it. She's lying in the guy's name. Yeah. She's lying on your name. That's, That's journey and repetition. That's fucked up, man. I hate bitches like that. I have bitches like that too on my fucking Facebook. Mm mm mm. Mm -mm -mm. But no one don't worry, be happy, bitch. Fuckers, we are done. I only did half because the other half I'm gonna do it tomorrow. Maybe with some tortas, bitch. I hate it when my thing is like up. I like it down. And these little thingies, my a lot of my sweaters don't have it because Baby Mario loves playing with them. Like you know, like like a, like a little cat. Baby Mario's like a little cat. So here we go, yo, yo to the yo to the yo yo yo. Mary Jane, I don't even know why I'm singing that song. So. This is how I played it for my chorizo. I know. I remember his brother used to make fun of me. Like, why do you do that? So I cut it up for him. I know, like a child, I know. But it's because I love him. And I don't, I don't know, I'm weird. Also, um, this is my brother-in-law's favorite food too. It's because of their mom, his mom, their mom would always make it for them. And that's why they love it. I tried to um, teach his ex bitch to do it. I remember one time his ex, um, she was like trying to like get him back or whatever. So she made it for him. And I mean, she did all right. But I told her I was gonna, I'll teach you girl, I'll teach you, but she didn't want to. Kind of getting hot in here. So I grab it with this. And halfway, I'm trying to teach something and sale todo madreado. Okay, like this, like that. And I like it cause it's nice and thin. The meat, see, nice and thin and pretty. Mm, should I get it more? Hold up. Can you tell which one's Mario's and which one's Mandy's plate? Not really, huh? They eat the same. They both love this food, so I have to put a lot of it. So I squirt some lemon on it because they're lo lemon lovers. Uh, see, and this one is Mario's plate, so he gets the salsita. I put it in the middle. Like so, yeah, ya acabamos. Mm -hmm. Mira que enchulada. I heated up the tortillas. Here we go, yo. Están las tortitas. Now I'm gonna tell him to come and get his food. Mm -hmm. With her plate, here's Mario. El pinche solo didn't come. I put it in a little thingy and they eat. Here we go, yo. You love it? <laughs> With your braces. It's all good. So Sofia, the motherfucking tortilla is in the house. Yay! Thank you, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you. With her dirty ass shirt. So yesterday, when we were este, reacting to the to the longaniza, she was actually mad at me. Yes. We were having a little thingy. It's because she always wants to be better than Mandy. And I tell her I do not like that. I don't like competition between sisters because it's like she's always saying, I'm better than you. I got better hair. I'm more thicker than you. What are you doing? It is warm. Por eso, pero lo vamos a poner allí para que se enfríe. No te lo pones en la boca y luego allí me voy a poner todos tus pinches germs ahí en el hocico. Yeah, she's always like competing with Mandy and I don't like that because they're both my daughters and there's no, shouldn't be any competition. And because I said, I said something about that, that's when she was eating, she was like, Cause she didn't want to do it, and I said, if you don't want to do the reacting thing with me, then don't I do did. it. I did. She did didn't want to do it with me, but she was a little annoyed yes. with me. But I don't know. I really liked it. Me too. You know, you don't have to like say you like everything I cook. Um, I did like it, but I was mad at my mommy. My mommy. So I'm just gonna. Are you gonna make a taco de milanesa? That's a thing. I. That's how I always eat it. You wanna eat it like this? You want me to cut it up for you? Yeah. I see? Yeah. And then we put limoncito. It's hot? No, that's fake. I know. 
No, we don't my like fake news. My mouth is not really bummer. Now, now you're trying to make up for the fuck up that you did. Mommy. It's okay, mami. Ya relájate. Yo no, yo no todo, I don't care. It's not that deep. So, aquí está la milanesa. I usually put it with rice, así. Porque that's how Mario eats it. So, I like to eat it. Like that. I hope it's in the mood. These lemons are so soft. I don't know why it's so hard for you. You literally just... I think... Creo que that's his way so I could do it for you. No. Mm -hmm. No. ¿Cómo le a... Look, guys. Look. They're soft. They're loosey. Mm -hmm. Even the, the newer ones. Mira. There's no salt. Mandy took the salt. Yeah. También. You, you don't have to squeeze a lot. Mm -hmm. Y dice que no puede. You lying, girl. You lying. No, no. I'm telling you, you don't even have to see it in the meat. It's perfection. Yes, mommy. Mm. Mm -mm. I'm so mm -mm. happy. Because mm -mm. after this, a couple minutes, and I'm, I'm going to eat dessert. Mm. Here, go bye. Yeah, I fucking love hate relationship with this little girl. We bump heads like a motherfucker. But at the end of the day, I love you, pinche mamona. I love you too. She's she reminds me so much of me. It's fucking crazy, and it's like the sneakiness that she does is like mind blowing. Like that's the same fucking shit that I did. You leo su little. You know how she thinks? Mm -hmm. I see right through those little sneaky eyes. I see right mm. through them. But anyways, motherfuckers, stay safe out there. And stay, remember to wash your hands. Wash that ass. And remember to not cough on people. Don't cough on people. You need to sneeze. Like, go the other way. Stay and six nothing. feet distance or some shit. I don't know. Just be careful out there, man. I don't want nobody to die. I don't want nothing to happen to anybody. I'm praying. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to stay positive. I don't want, I don't really like to watch the news porque me da cosa. Ugh. I don't know. You know, say, chinga su madre. A toda madre o un desmadre, bitch. Anyways, to all my bird gang, 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 motherfucking <laughs> peace and motherfucking love.